All right, Cyclist so fans, another review of my previous channel. It's Love Circles. Love Circles around the world. Let's check it out. I don't know if it starts in a club. I think it's Paris somewhere. This dude oh. here meets a chick named hey, well, Susie. Come on. Let's blow this joint. Things escalate quickly. Go back to her place. I find it exciting, don't you? Yeah, very. You can tell how excited I am, can't you? I think that means he has a boner. Hey, not bad. Thanks. You naughty boy. That is exciting. She then strips down to her negligee. I couldn't show you how far they took things. But the next morning, I actually think it's night, she leaves him a note. And then he wakes up in a store. Where's I it? woke in the morning to a big surprise. I discovered I'd spent the night in a furniture store. And I wasn't the only person to be surprised. So Susie's gone. He quickly gets dressed. Finds a pack of cigarettes that had Susie's name on them. The dude then checks into a hotel somewhere else. He meets another lady. This is Josephine Jacqueline Jones. She plays Bridget. Say, aren't you the DJ at Carol Club? She invites him into her place, and she gets frisky with him too. You might remember her from the movie Black hey, Venus. You've had a little nap. Now, want me to call the locksmith? She makes it clear with her animalistic sound that she wants him. This wasn't just a woman, she was a tigress. But finally, everything began to slow down. Just as I reached the climax of the whole affair, I fell asleep. There were some Benny Hill moments with her chasing him down, which I couldn't show you because they were both naked. So she left him, and she ended up taking the cigarettes, and now we follow her to her next rendezvous. Hello, Bridget. Or are we following the cigarettes? She ends up meeting this Count. Yes? Yes, Your Highness. Uh, he is an unbeliever. But he, uh, can, uh, he can build your terminal for uh, 14 million less. She's there I to sell him some rings or something. But I think he has other things on his mind too. Some of them are extraordinarily large. <laughs> Pretty soon he places her in handcuffs. <laughs> And they're gonna get frisky, which I can't really show you much more of this. Well, she ends up leaving eventually, and she ended up leaving the cigarettes behind, which our count is about to find. Where will they go next? Well, he goes to play some cards in the casino, and gets a little note sent to him. Join me to the toilet. Well, who can pass that up? Cash out. 20 seconds of film time later, the two are getting passionate in the toilet. You got a hell of a nerve walking in like that. What if Gino saw you? He's Italian, he's hot blooded. She leaves him satisfied. And I think she now has the cigarettes. Oh! <laughs> Can't really show you much in the next one, but she ends up in a bathhouse with a guy. Tell me the truth. Where did you get this? Oh, this is fast about the face. I'm gonna break his neck. And then we'll have an answer for us in the morning. Turns out the ring is worthless. Of course, it's easy to be fooled at first. Particularly with such extraordinary craftsmanship. I'm sorry, but the ring is worthless. Please. Oh. 
I mean, Next you thing you know, we're on an airplane. Nice to with you. I'm so grateful to you for He's got the cigarettes. Fly. He's about to I get some too. I even remember to bring you these herbal cigarettes. What? They join the Mile High Club and the plane rocks. <laughs> So that's the lady who was with the pilot. I noticed a man was staring at me. The dude on the train is like following her. Hey, wait! So these cigarettes have gone around the world now. I'll tell you. What? About his money. Do you know where he gets all his money? Business. He has his own business. business. Yes. Business being drugs. Look, he's, a, he's the largest drug dealer in Southeast Asia. You don't know that? No. Blake, he sounds quite good looking. I think... This is her sister. He'll kill the story about my husband if I sleep with him tonight. But if I were to do so and my husband found out, I would kill myself. So he's a reporter and he's going to expose her husband's drug dealings unless she agrees to sleep with him, which she does. However, she's going to have her twin sister, or at least look like sister, sleep with him instead. You'll never know. So the switcheroo is on. He doesn't know the difference, and I don't think he'd care if he did. When they're all done, the switch is returned. Anyway, the reporter now has George the cigarettes and he ends up with a different George. lady. Who's George? He's a chauffeur. Oh. He's very discreet. Hi, George. They start to get frisky in the limo. Toss the panties out the window, and it is on. I think so. What are those? What these? They're funny little things I take. They're strange. They're supposed to be good, but they're herbal. I got them in Hong Kong. From a girl I met there. Oh, excuse me. She ends up going to New York, and she has the I funny cigarettes with her. Audition. So I decided to do a little window shopping. It had to be that, because I had no money. She ends up posing for some pictures for this guy. Beautiful. Can't show you a whole lot more of this. Turn a little bit more now. Turn a little bit more for me, please. He has one of the cigarettes. But what I'd really he romances her, keeps the cameras person. rolling, and you can use you your imagination. You can't be talking about an undress rehearsal. I just can't wait for a big Well, that guy then ends up in a club, and lo and behold, that's Susie from the beginning of the movie. To America. Chunks and contents. And she ends up getting a hold of the cigarettes from him. But... That's my path. I wrote that. Who was it? Jacques? Jack. 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 And that's our film. All right, let's talk about Love Circles, also known as Love Circles Around the World. Uh, this is a movie that um, I originally taped off of cable, God, back in 1989, maybe. I had on a, had on a tape with three other movies. Uh, Love, Loss, and Ecstasy was one of them. don't remember the other two, but anyway, it was like, yeah. So anyway, this was uh, one of like many nudie movies that uh, 
uh, cable was show back in the 80s, you know, late at night. Um, this one, you know, very similar uh, like stuff like Island of Thousands of Lights and Joy of Flying, Vanessa, that kind of stuff. Um, this one is an interesting film. Uh, it's a lot of nudity in it. Josephine Jacqueline Jones is the only person of any renown, and she doesn't really have that much renown. Uh, she was in the movie Black Venus, which I reviewed a few weeks ago. She was allegedly a Miss Bahamas, uh, but I looked up Miss Bahamas today, and I could not find any record of Josephine Jacqueline Jones ever being a participant, let alone a winner, unless she was going by a different name. Somewhere, uh, maybe it was on IMDb, said that she was Miss Bahamas 1979. Uh, but Miss Bahamas 1979 is not Josephine Jacqueline Jones, and the lady who is listed as 1979 Miss Bahamas doesn't look like Josephine Jacqueline Jones. So I don't know what the hell is going on with Josephine Jacqueline Jones, but I don't even know if, if she even existed because um, uh, there's no record of like anything of her online other than some references to the couple of movies that she made. Is she a real person? Change name? I have no idea. But anyway, I digress. Love circles around the world. It starts out uh, with this uh, man and this woman having this little tryst. Um, I think they're in Paris somewhere. And um, uh, the guy gets kind of screwed over and he ends up losing everything. But he manages to grab this pack of cigarettes, which belong to the woman. I think her name was Susie. And then uh, we follow this guy then. He gets away from there and he ends up sleeping with another woman. And then that woman takes the... Uh, cigarettes they just kind of get passed from person to person these cigarettes do and uh then we see um the various sexual sexual escapades that each person has along the way so it's like the the cigarettes are, are, are the central theme in this movie they just move from person to person to person to person uh one person has sex with somebody else, and then that person basically grabs the cigarettes, goes and has sex with somebody else, and that person grabs the cigarettes, goes and has somebody, sex with somebody else. This isn't like planned or anything. It's just happenstance that they happen to grab the other person's cigarettes and take off with them. And then we see that person's next sexual conquest. So, And then at the very end of this movie, uh, the last guy to have sex ends up having sex with the woman who was the very first woman who had sex at the beginning of the movie. Susie, I think, was her name. And she sees the cigarettes and is like, oh, those are mine. Um, meanwhile, she has no idea that those cigarettes went all around the world uh, before they finally landed back in her lap. Uh, maybe a week has passed since all this happened. And then, again, along the way, we see all these sexual adventures and the people making out. And that's the film. That is the essence of Love Circles. Now, um, there's a lot of nudity in this movie. There's some male nudity, uh, full frontal male and female nudity, actually, in this movie. So if you're into wieners, we got a wiener in this one, at least one. And uh, Josephine Jacqueline Jones was in, in the uh, 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 routine where it's almost like a Benny Hill thing where they're running around real fast, that sort of thing. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, it's a dubbed film. I think this is French. Uh, I could be wrong about that, but um, uh, it's dubbed in English. And uh, there's not much more to tell about this movie. Uh, this was put out by... Uh, can't even tell. PrivateScreeningsCollection.com. I should probably check PrivateScreeningsCollection.com and see what else they have because there might be some other films I need in my collection. But that's it. Love Circles. Again, just a silly little 80s romp um, that used to show up on cable late night. I'm probably one of few people who's ever seen this movie or at least remembers seeing this movie, and now I have it in my collection too. I believe I had a pre-recorded VHS of this also. Um, yeah. That's it. Uh, check it out. I'll leave a link to something down below to uh, purchase it on Amazon if you're wanting to get it. And um, you want a relic of the 80s full of nudity? This is one to get. Check it out. Leave some comments. Love circles. Watch it. Bye.